It's Mel. I am back with another order from Sassy Girl Roma, and I'm very, very, very excited about this one because it is the Valentine's box. Yay! So it is right now mid January. My plan is to upload this video on Valentine's Day, at least make it public on Valentine's Day. So um, my fiance couldn't be here for this one. This order came in, I actually ordered two boxes, the Valentine's box and also the triple X rated naughty Valentine's themed box. So he, he promised he's going to do the video with the triple X rated one with me, but I'll just go ahead and do this one on my own. Now I will say when this order arrived, everything was beautifully packaged as, as always. Everything was wrapped in either pink or blue tissue paper. Really beautiful. It was like opening presents because although I ordered the boxes and paid for them, I had no idea what the scents would be or what the wax would look like. And let me tell you, I am not disappointed. This is so exciting. So first, let me go ahead. She sent three samples and they were sitting right on top. So this first is, and these are just regular chunks. They're not in the special shape. Um, so this first one is Strawberry Satsuma. probably opened everything. I tried to be cognizant of all the crinkling noises, so my apologies. So you first get that citrusy smell. That is the prevalent scent, but the strawberry is not far behind. That's very good. I've been, I don't know why, I've been melting a lot more fruity flavor and fruity scents recently, so this works out really well. Green apples and spearmint ice cream. That's an interesting combo. And this is just really, really pretty wax. So I get this spearmint right away. It is not knock you over strong. And then I get a whiff of apples. And it's more of a tart apple, as you would expect a green apple to be. That's really good. I like spearmint. Um, I've smelled some really strong spearmint, um, but that one is not very strong, which is good. Sometimes it can be too strong for my taste. Um, so the second, the th excuse me, the third sample is another strawberry satsuma. So awesome. Now on for the main attraction. And let me just tell you how beautiful this wax is. Um, we were already playing with it because I was so <laughs> excited. Because again, I needed to unwrap it so I could celebrate, so I could separate the x-rated stuff from the clean friendly stuff uh i will put an age restriction on the other wax i mean i don't think i'd get in trouble with youtube but you know I, it, this is wax it's supposed to be innocent and fun um so just in case you're watching videos you have kids in the room you know it's gonna prompt you to enter your age and maybe that would just be a reminder so they don't see inappropriate images. You know, I'm doing this more for other people than my own um, needs. I don't think any of it is too terrible, the X-rated wax, but just in case. But again, this one's really friendly. And this is Crisp Apple Rose. So this does have a floral note, but I'm also getting more of that like um, Macintosh apple as well. Um, I'm not a huge floral scent, so the floral... It concerns me how I'm gonna like it in the warmer. And again, that's just my my preference. Um, but it's the, the apple scent is so good. So I'm gonna give it a try. Um, and I'm hoping I'll be pleased with that. Every nose is different. I'm just not a huge fan of florals. But again, that apple is so good. I think there's a good chance I might like this more than I typically would a floral scent. Okay. And we have red lipstick, and this is a big Hershey Kiss. Look at that. So pretty. Oh, and that is the typical red lipstick, that like really luscious cherry smell. Delicious. Not really good. I'm, not really going in any particular order, although I am saving one for last. 
So these are, uh, this is buttermint candies and I love buttermint. And these are little conversation hearts. Look how cute these are. Sweetheart. Oh, and the smell. I can already get that buttermilk or buttermint. It's slightly minty, but also sweet. This one says, I don't think so. Hot stuff. <laughs> Do you guys like those conversation hearts? I think they're cute, but I just can't stand the taste of them. I love you. It's cute. Kiss me. Be mine. True love. Reminds me of uh, Princess Bride and XOXO. And this is an awesome, awesome set. Um, again, it's that sweetness. And if you've never had a buttermint, they're just so delicious. They're one of my favorite mints. Um, I have them maybe once every two years. You know, occasionally you'll come across a restaurant that serves them. Um, and I just love them. And that scent is so good. Okay, what do we want to do next? Let's do the chocolate box. Let's do the box of chocolates. And this is in Chocolate Orchid, which I've seen this scent listed before, and I'm not too familiar with it. But look how stinking cool that wax is. That is so talented. So it definitely, it has, it's a floral scent. Hmm. I'm getting floral. I don't... See, I don't know what chocolate orchid is supposed to be. Maybe you guys can comment and let me know what the scent profile is. I'm just getting floral, um, but my nose isn't really geared to the floral scent, so I don't know if I'm just not picking up on something. Could be. Um, hmm. So this is Passionate Kisses. Now the nice thing is that none of my wax ever goes to waste. I always find a home for it. So even if it's a scent I don't really care for, I find a, someone who loves it. Passionate Kisses. Again, I'm not familiar with this either. So this is more fruity. With maybe some sort of perfume note or floral note in there. Oh, or perfume, I mean, not floral. That one, that one's okay. I like that. Um, it's not overly perfumey. Again, I feel like there's a fruity note. If you're familiar with this, again, please comment. Let me know. Sometimes my nose, I found, is very off. And people correct me Woo! later. Sorry, knocked over my phone. They correct me later and tell me what the scent really is. So here is Bite Me, which I won't open up since I already have a Bite Me. Um, but this one says, To My Valentine. You can see it through the plastic. And it's a really pretty shade of pink with a nice heart there. That's really sweet. It's like, a, okay, I lie. Maybe I will take it off because it looks like there's something. Oh, that might have just gotten a little nick or something in there. Or maybe it was a little hard. I love Bite Me. My fiance doesn't like it at all, which is fine. You know, I I just melt it when he's not home or he's not around. He's in and out. I like it. Okay, let's do this one. So this is in Lick Me All Over. Wait till you see the... She did an awesome job with the X-rated wax. Let me just tell you, I can't wait for you guys to see that video. And I will actually probably post that before um, this one goes up. I think I'm just going to go ahead and post that video once it's finished processing, once we film it and process it and put it up. I'm not going to wait for Valentine's for that one. Um, so once this video is up, if you haven't seen it, I'll put the link to it below. Um, so look how cute this, and look how much talent this takes to do the different colors. It's impressive. And that's like me all over, if you're familiar. It's not my favorite scent, but again, for this order, this was not about me choosing scents. Um, this was just about getting really fun holiday wax. And frankly, to try some new scents that I, I don't wear, um, that's always a good thing. You know, she, uh, Julie, who owns Sassy Girl Aroma, she had contacted me because she had seen one of my videos that I don't like banana. 
and she was trying to avoid banana. And I really appreciate that, although I don't want a vendor to ever think that um, they shouldn't put a certain scent in my, I mean, I stay away from ordering certain scents for myself, but because I do that, I don't get to try them and I don't know if I'll fall in love with them. So she is really great to try it, to be on the lookout for that sort of thing, but it's not necessary. And even though I might not fall in love with all of these scents, it's still really great that I get the opportunity to try them. So no, this was my fault. This had been in there before, I think, or maybe it had been in this one. Um, and I must have broken it. So this is Sex in the Shower. Look how cute it is. Like you hold the key to my heart. Or it could be a very upsetting wax if you just do it like that. <laughs> so this is good. It is, again, I don't know what the scent description for this is, but it is very bright and fruity and it has citrus notes to it. Or maybe a cherry note. It's awesome. I love it. It reminds me a lot of Bite Me. That is yummy, yummy. Sometimes my nose is so off. Like, I'll say something, I'll describe a scent some way, and, or I, I'll do that on Facebook pages, and people are like, um, no, this is the scent you mean. And I'm like, oh, yeah, they're dead on. So, I am just don't have the best nose. All right, so this one is Pink Chiffon Lavender Birthday. And I at first thought this was, oh, okay, it's just like a little piece of chunk. Or not little, you know, this is good four melts in here. So it wasn't until I turned it over that I noticed. Look how gorgeous that is. Is that not entirely impressive? That is so cool. And it's good. You get the, I get the birthday cake right away. And I get a slight floral from the lavender, and then you get the pink chiffon. That, that is fantastic. It is a beautiful scent. I'm going to love it. Okay. So lots of fruities, some florals, bakery. And now for my favorite. And this might be the best thing I've ever seen in wax since I've been doing wax. Or buying wax, I should say. So first of all, this is in Misbehaven. Look at this. This is all wax and it's a box with these XOXOs in there. How stinking cute is this? Oh my God. It smells awesome. But look at this. Look at this box. I mean, look at the detail down in there. And then it has the little XOXOs. How cool is this? And the fact that this whole sucker is wax. I've never, I, again, I, I know I've only been doing this since July, but this is awesome. I've never seen one like this. And this alone was what made my order. I mean, all the wax is just gorgeous, but I was so impressed. She is so creative. I love the molds she picked out. You did an awesome job. Thank you for the samples. That was so generous. If you are 18 or older, and you have a good sense of humor, and you're not offended by slightly naughty things, click the link below for the triple X rated wax order, also from Sassy Girl Aroma. And keep an eye out, because I am sure I will be placing more orders with Sassy Girl very soon. All right guys, take care, and I will talk to you later.